Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? How you been? Yeah, I know it's been a long time, but um, you know, I've been busy. I've been working. And um, yes, I am still out on the road. I am still a trucker. Yes, I'm still right here in my truck. And um, I am officially a trucker because um, I have so settled into this lifestyle. And um, I love it. I, I really love it. It's, it's crazy. Um, when I spoke to you last, I was changing companies. Um, I had just come out of my starter company that sent me to trucking school. And um, went out and marketed my, you know, threw my resume out there. And um, a pow, you know, all these different companies started buying for me. And I picked the best one. And um, I've been working with them going on a year now. I'll make a year here in um, April, beginning of April. I'll mark two years trucking um, also in the beginning of April. So it's a big milestone. And um, I have to say it's been worth it. I'm going to stay out here a while longer because guess what? I am reaching goals. Remember in the first videos where I said uh, I wanted to buy a house. I'm, I'm out here. I'm going to you know get secured get that security make enough money and buy my myself a house well guess what I am now at that point where I am looking uh, I'm looking for a house I'm ready uh, I got my money saved up I have been out here for the past year racking and stacking and um, yeah it, it's been happening uh, the money's been rolling in and um, you know, I've been looking. There's so so much property. One of the benefits of one one of the benefits of being a trucker is that I've gotten to see what's out here across the entire country. And um, my biggest problem right now is deciding where to live. Um, I'm not even sure if I want to go back to New York, um, even though New York is still close to my heart. Uh, there is pump. Uh, there is ample property available up there more towards the upstate uh, areas uh, and I'm considering getting a piece of property up there but also since my family's in North Carolina I'm looking at houses in North Carolina and South Carolina and there's available property everywhere I'm even considering living in states I've never lived in before like uh, you get great deals in Iowa like I could get a, a $50,000 house in Iowa and it would be amazing you know if I could live in Iowa but um you know be more strategic I really do want to be closer to more the hub of things like you know New York and if I move to North Carolina it'll be more like Charlotte some place like that anyway um the big deal is just where I've managed to get myself by trucking um this industry actually has helped me to reach that goal uh one of the great things about living out here being an OTR driver which is what I am over the road is that I eliminated all those bills so that's how I've been able to save the money um, living here living in my truck um, I don't have to pay rent I'm not paying a light bill I'm not paying for water I'm not paying for cable uh, you know except for my Verizon uh, you know my phone connection my hot that's my hot spot and I get everything through that so um, I've been able to eliminate a lot of um, a lot of bills and that has been enabled me to stack my money I mean I mean stack my money I've been like I said racking and stacking and I have more than enough money to um, do my down payment for a house and beyond that I'm gonna stay out here a longer a little longer once I get the house and decide where I'm gonna live and do all that stuff um, I'm gonna stay out here longer so I can pay the house off really quick yep I see myself staying out here at least another year, at least another year, maybe two, and um, so that when I settle, I can just lay back in my crib, lay back in my, on my property. I want acres. I'm trying to find something on acres because land is very important to me. So once I lay back, I won't have to be stressing about mortgages. You know, mortgage will be like, yay, small, because I'm a, I'm gonna um, you know make it. I'm gonna make sure to get it down like that and. Uh, yeah, and then by having this CDL, I could work locally if I want, or I don't even have to be a trucker anymore. I don't even have to do trucking. Um, I plan to really set myself up financially, and um, yeah, it's a great thing. I'm feeling accomplished, and I'm feeling optimistic, and I'm feeling happy because I've reached uh, a point that I wanted to get to, and I'm there. So uh, I'll keep you posted. I guess when I start. Uh, 
signing the papers and doing all that stuff and you know finally deciding which house <laughs> so in the meantime I also have one thing else I want to say um, I know there's a lot of people out here there are a lot of people out here that may be struggling or also with this crazy administration that we have right now the tax cuts that are gonna soon you're gonna be feeling them soon a lot of stuff is getting cut and there are a lot of you out there that are probably looking for jobs in your area and you're finding yourself going, coming up against brick walls. Um, I recommend trucking. Okay, if you're not already, uh, if you don't have, if you're single, it's perfect. Uh, if you're a couple, but hey, both of you could come out here and, and make it, make a go of it. You understand? There are couples out here. I have run into, I ran into this couple that's been out here trucking for eight years and they have saved up just under a million dollars now I know that doesn't sound like a lot but do you have under or just under a million dollars okay plus what they have houses they have a couple of houses and they have land so and that's from just being out here she said like eight and a half years her and her husband have been out here so anyway my next video I'm gonna come back and get you guys anybody that's interested in trucking I'm gonna give you the basics I'm gonna give you the straight in the door um, um, action as far as you know information and um, pl places companies that'll send you to school so you don't have to pay a penny out of your pocket just like I did I didn't pay a penny um, to get this amazing career you know this amazing job uh, where I'm able to make money like I am right now so yep that's what I'm gonna do uh, so yeah stay tuned and I swear to God <laughs> I'm coming right back this time I am because I'm I, I want to help and and like I said we're in these crazy times right now and I run into and besides trucking oh there's also this whole underside of the transportation industry in warehousing uh, in in the logistics side of it and I'm meeting people in in these warehouses and I've just gotten to know this whole world so even if you don't want to drive a truck there are so many different opportunities in the industry and I'm gonna give you the skinny on that how to get into that you just get a forklift certification and you can get some of those jobs in there and um, even if you don't want to drive a for forklift there's there's a million jobs in within um, the uh, transportation and the freight industry okay so I'm gonna be useful to you yes I am all right uh once again those of you that hung in there because i know i've been very ne very negligent but those of you that are still here thank you and god bless you and um i appreciate you i really do and um coming back at you coming back uh with some good stuff okay so in the meantime ciao for now bye